Hello class. In our last session, we have seen the Boyle's law, the statement, and we have derived the mathematical expression for it. Last expression that we, we derived was P1 into V1 equals to P2 into V2. Now, based on that equation, Boyle's law equation, today we are going to see the numerical. Okay. So, the question is example one. The question is a gas occupies 800 centimeter cube under 760 millimeter mercury pressure. Find out what pressure the gas will occupy 380 centimeter cube, the temperature remaining constant. So this is a question. Now how to solve this question? So first what you need to do is, first you'll write down the givens. What are the givens in the question? Say for example, there is a thing, a gas occupies 800 centimeter cube. So centimeter cube is a volume and under 760 millimeter mercury pressure so the value for p1 that is initial pressure we can say it's 760 millimeter mercury and v1 volume 1 that is initial volume is 800 centimeter cube and after that you are asked to find out find out at what pressure that means you need to find the value for p2 will occupy the volume of 380 centimeter cube so this is the final volume, the value for V2, 380 centimeter cube. Now, you need to calculate P2. So, from Boyle's law, and since why you are using Boyle's law? Since the condition is given, the temperature remaining constant. So, by Boyle's law, we have got P1, V1 equals to P2, V2. So, we will substitute the values. 760 into 800 in equals to P2, because we need to calculate P2 into 380. So when you just simplify it, P2 will be equal to 760 into 3, uh, 760 into 800, and this 380 will come down. And when you just multiply and divide it 380, it will come as 1600. And since you are asked to find out the pressure, and over here, the unit is very very important. While doing the numerical, the unit the unit is very very important. 700, uh, sorry, 1600 millimeter mercury you convert this into centimeter you need to divide by 10 it becomes 160 centimeter mercury so the required pressure is 7, uh, 160 centimeter mercury this is how we are going to solve the numerical based on Boyle's law so for your assignment based on the numerical of Boyle's law formula that we need to use to use this one p1 v1 equals to p2 v2 so we have got question number one is volume of certain amount of a gas at 25 degrees celsius and 100 centimeter mercury pressure is 80 ml the gas is expanded to 160 ml keeping the temperature constant calculate the pressure of the expanded gas question number two we have got so in this first question you need to calculate the pressure that means the value for p2 in question number two it is at a particular temperature at a particular temperature a certain quantity of gas occupies a volume of seven foot uh, uh, 74 centimeter cube at a pressure of 760 millimeter if the pressure is decreased to 740 millimeter what will be the volume of the gas at the same temperature so first you'll write down the givens and here you need uh, you're asked to find out the value for v2 so you'll use this uh, Boyle's law equation to calculate the required terms. 